Welcome back to LPTV and our first episode of the 2017-18 through 18 school year. I'm Lajeen Manji. And I'm Kaylee Hartnoff. This year, the LPTV staff will bring you news, entertainment, feature stories, and sports coverage from around AL and the community. A lot has happened here at AL that we'd like to look back on. Here's a look at some moments from last year, which were pretty amazing in themselves. Morales. This has been Ajin Manji reporting for LPTV. I'm Kenny Gray reporting for LPTV. Though it's nice to look back on the past, it's also nice to move forward. Our LPTV team headed out to Glenwood last week to check out cross country and. With the first meet of the season, the girls and boys cross country teams started off at Glenwood. The JV girls ran first with their top runner, Riley Fichter, getting a time of 25 minutes and 52 seconds. She placed 27th out of 67 runners. The JV team finished with a team total of 154 points, placing 6th in the meet, beating Thomas Jefferson. The varsity girls ran next. Two girls placed in the top 15. Claire Wilder finished with a time of 21 minutes and 38 seconds, and Claire Jones with a time of 21 minutes and 43 seconds. The varsity team finished with a team total of 109 points, placing fourth, beating Lewis Central and Thomas Jefferson. The JV boys ran next, with their top runner, Adam Dressmeyer, getting a time of 20 minutes and 40 seconds. He placed 12th out of 98 runners. The JV team finished with a team total of 184 points, placing 6th, beating Shenandoah and Clorinda. The varsity boys ran next, with their top runner Caleb Linen finishing in the top 15. He placed 7th with a time of 18 minutes and 34 seconds. The varsity team finished with a team total of 120 points, placing 4th, beating Atlantic, Harlan, Shenandoah, Clorinda, and East Mills. The next cross-country meet is Saturday, September 2nd at Iowa Western at 8.45 a.m. Good luck to the boys and girls. This has been Claire Plummer and Zach Potter reporting for LPTV. Thanks for the highlights. Let's take a look at some stories that will be in our next episode. Make sure that you join us next week for another episode of LPTV. And don't forget to head out to Lewis Central tonight for the football game. Both schools are coming together to collect clothing items to send to those affected by Hurricane Harvey. Bring any extra clothing that you'd like to donate to the game. We will see you next week, Al. From all the staff here at LPTV, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching.